out here in Grand Isle, Louisiana. I'm trying to catch some big old speckle trout early in the morning. First light. I'll just start throwing this top water around. See if we can get some. Got a north wind. Oh, I got shrimp popping over here. get him <laughs> probably should just take him in the shore that's where that mono and that soft rod come in handy oh come on <laughs> Let me go over here. <laughs> I know. I'm trying. I'm trying to stay on him. <laughs> this is wild. All right, I got it. I got it. I have no idea. <laughs> I'm trying to trying to keep him. Oh, he's barely hooked. Actually, that bitch got two hooks in him. Hey, look, grab this thing. If I get a hook in me, <laughs> that's fun. <laughs> <coughs> Can't catch nothing. And then we snag a cork. Catch a big old red fish. <laughs> oh man. That's yeah. cool. Oh no, a big old a nice flounder. Yes. Yes. All I need is a redfish to finish the day, man. Yeah, get the slam. There we go. Give me a flounder. I knew they had something around there. Oh, Lord. Did you bring them friggin' pliers? All you right, did? Well, this was April 20th, last Saturday, and had that one trout that you see in the video that trout actually got off right by the bank but i did catch another one so i did get the slam and i snagged that cork that had a redfish running down the thing we was just driving by elma's island and down one of the little canals that had a redfish with a cork on it and i uh, threw a rattle trap out there and snagged it real quick so <laughs> caught that and then we went to another spot called a flounder but uh they had a lot of glass minnows out there they had trout further out but I just couldn't walk there, and we didn't have a kayak or a boat or anything. We were just bank fishing, and the water was dirty that day. Sunday, the water cleaned up from everything that I've seen, all the reports and everything else. But Saturday, that north wind had coming out of the pass looking like the river. So it just wasn't a very good day. They had a lot of sheephead around the bank. So if you like sheephead and you want to go catch them, you can go right off the side of the road in Grand Isle and catch sheephead. I had to see probably about 10 sheephead just right off the bank. With polarized glasses, look in the water, throw a little piece of shrimp or a little fiddler crab. You can go catch them in the marsh, them little them little crabs. And um, I guarantee you catch them. Just throw them out there with like a little jig head or something. But they're kind of spooky, so you got to kind of want to lay low. 
But uh, Speck will try to be picking up out there if you get clean water, you know. I mean, the water was so dirty, and then the fish were just way away from us. You got to understand, when we bank fishing, it's you don't have that ability to just get up and move. And everywhere we even thought to went, it was dirty. If we looked at the beach, it was chocolate milk. Coming out of past chocolate milk. Uh, on the side of the road, it was clear and nice. And we caught that redfish, and we caught that flounder, and... That was it. But hit the slam. Uh, we're going to be going out there a lot more. Uh, I'll be getting something pretty cool soon, so y'all going to see that. That's going to be, I'm really excited about this. So so hopefully we can pick up some more fish later on. We're going to start working on the trout quest video. I want to catch me a big giant trout. Just got to get the motivation. I need the motivation. But I'm going to make it happen. And uh, until next time, I'm going to check out later. Peace.